गुड मॉर्निंग डियर स्टूडेंट्स आई होप यू ऑल आर वेल एंड फाइन एट होम सो आई एम योर ई वी एस टीचर मिस काजल कामरा टूडे आई एल बी टीचिंग यू चैप्टर नंबर सिक्स एंड वॉट इज द चैप्टर नेम द वर्ल्ड ऑफ प्लांट्स सो लेट्स स्टार्ट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट मी डिस्कस यू अबाउट द टाइप्स ऑफ प्लांट्स दैट वी हैव एज यू कैन सी इन द पिक्चर डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ प्लांट्स आर देयर श्रब्स आर देयर ट्रीज आर देयर हर्ब्स आर देयर क्लाइंबर्स आर देयर क्रीपर्स आर देयर सो इन दिस चैप्टर वी शैल लर्न अबाउट द डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ प्लांट्स अबाउट द लीव्स एंड द वेरियस यूजेज ऑफ लीव्स सो नाउ आई एल बी एक्सप्लेनिंग यू द ट्रीज टॉपिक फर्स्ट सो ट्रीज टॉल बेग एंड स्ट्रॉन्ग प्लांट्स आर कॉल ट्रीज they usually live for a long period of time and some of them have very bright colorful flowers and they also gives us fruit many trees have leaves all the years around and but some trees shed their leaves in winter the examples of the trees are peepal tree palm tree ashok tree pine tree neem tree trees have strongly wood barks and have many branches Trees stand erect. Erect means they stand straight. They have a thick brown and woody stem called trunk. Trees gives us shade, fruits, and wood. As you can see in the picture, there are some many plants around us. Some are big and some are small. You can see the few examples of trees are mango tree. You can see the picture of the coconut tree, pine tree. peepal tree banyan tree and the neem tree these plants are tall big and strong and tall big and strong plants are called trees next we have another type of plants that are known as climbers children climbers are often referred as the small plants they are the plants with the weak stems they must climb on other plants or stick or walls to grow they need support to grow they cannot stand on their own so you can see in the picture the example of a climber plant another type of plants we have children are creepers creeper plants have soft green stem they always grow along the ground as you can see in the picture some examples of creepers are pumpkin watermelon musk melon they grow along the ground Next we have another kind of plants that are known as shrubs. Shrubs are small to medium sized woody plants. They grow up to a height of 5 to 6 meters and they are smaller than the trees. As you can see in the picture also that they have many branches and they have very strong stems. Next we have another kind of plants that are known as herbs. herbs are small plants with soft green and tender stems and small roots examples you can see rice grass coriander mint these are the examples of herbs run next part of the chapter is the different types of leaves where do the leaves grow leaves grow on the branches and they are of different shapes and sizes as you can see in the picture there is a walnut leaf birch leaf maple leaf oak leaf ash leaf and so on the different kinds of leaves the plants have Now we are going to discuss about the uses of leaves for the medicinal purpose like leaves of betel tulsi and neem do have medicinal use juice of tulsi leaves is very useful for cough and neem leaves as we all know they are very good for our health There are some uses of leaves for design and decoration. Leaves of mango or ashoka are used for making torans to hang them at the doors during functions. Powder of dry mandi leaves are also used to make beautiful designs on hand and feet. Now, one more important function of the leaf that leaves helps in the process of photosynthesis. Leaves have a pigment children that are known as chlorophyll which gives them the green color that's why leaves are able to make their own food with the help of air water and sunlight and this process is known as photosynthesis i hope children all have understood this chapter with the help of this video 
थैंक यू एंड हैव अ गुड डे एंड डू टेक केयर अ वेरी गुड केयर ऑफ योर सेल्फ